Welcome to another edition of our Keelan Select Pick of the Week as we focus on the 139th running of the Preakness second leg of the Triple Crown. It's a field of 10 headed by the odds-on favorite Kentucky Derby winner California Chrome. Naturally, I'm going to try to pick against a heavy favorite like that, and I'm going to take a shot with Social Inclusion, the eight horse in here. First, take a look at this horse's last race in the Wood Memorial. Breaking from the 10 hole, he breaks badly, and the jock has to use him to get position going around the first turn. A lot of times when horses are used in that fashion, they get keyed up, and you can't basically switch them off. But this horse switched off, relaxed, and really finished pretty strong at the eight ball. Looked like he was still going to win the race. Grudgingly gave ground and ended up just getting nipped for second place. He didn't start until he was a three-year-old, and in that way, this horse reminds me of 2000 Preakness winner Red Bullet, who really got good quickly, like Social Inclusion did. Take a look at that second start. A 111 buyer figure is the highest buyer number in this field. So those are enough reasons at five to one, maybe a little better, to take a shot with Social Inclusion in the Preakness. If you're looking to play tries or, or supers, I think Kid Cruz, number seven, is an interesting long shot because there's a lot of speed in here, and he's the most stone-cold closer in this field. But social inclusion is my pick to win the Preakness. Now let's check in with Katie Gensel. Thanks, Tom. Well, I think the big question in everyone's mind is, will California Chrome do it? Will he win the second leg of the Triple Crown? Well, I do think the Kentucky Derby winner does have a chance. He screams out on paper. He looks very good over the Pimlico track in the morning. He looked very good in his Wednesday morning gallop, so I'm going to use him. He will be a heavy favorite. He's 3-5 to five in the morning line, but he's a good key horse, and who knows? We hopefully will have a Triple Crown winner. Hasn't been done since 1978. So I'm going to use him on top. A few long shots to use underneath because everyone else will be a long shot or at least coming in at a good price. I'm going to use General A-Rod. I think uh, he's leading into this race in great form. Did not get uh, quite the trip he wanted in the Kentucky Derby, but he should be forwardly placed from the gate, breaking from post position number two. Social inclusion looks like the speed of the speed with Bayern running with blinkers off. And if there is a contested pace, one that could come flying late is Ride on Curlin. I'm going to use him also underneath. But again, I think it's all California Chrome coming up in the Preakness Stakes. Kiam in your Exactus, Trifectus, Superfectus. Looking forward to him competing, and hopefully we'll be watching him again in about three weeks' time. So best of luck to everyone betting on the Preakness and make all your wagers at KeenlandSelect.com.